Hello YouTube, in this video tutorial of JB Touch Apps, we're going to show you how to get and correctly use Boss Paper. So the first thing we want to do is open up the iPod. Of course, that's... Sorry about the lag again, it's always going to do that, but it looks clear now. Now we want to go to Cydia. Let's just wait for this to load, I'll pause it. Alright YouTube, it loaded, let's just... Downloading release. I don't even see what this is for here. But I'm going to wait. Um, I'll just pause it and I'll shoot it when it's done reloading the data. All right, YouTube. Now it's done loading. Um, now next thing we want to do is go to search, and then note this will not work on firmware 4.2.1. Just a heads up right there. Let's type in boss paper. Here we go, and then the it's from Big Boss. That makes sense. Sorry, so just installing everything, and I already have it. So. Yeah, you see, it has iOS 4.2 warning, anyways. So our next thing we want to do is go to our home page, and we should have the icon that says Boss Paper, a little paintbrush. It's in my dock right there. So let's open it up. All right. Next thing you want to do is um. Enable boss paper and then go to individual pictures. There shouldn't be anything there for you, so just click add and then there'll be options there. If you don't have any pictures that you want to add, I can show you how to get them. So uh, we want to open back up Cydia and I should probably pause this and just wait till it opens up. So hold on. Alright, YouTube, it's, oh, it's loading. Alright, so we want to go to sections, Insidia, go to add-ons, boss paper, and then there will be um, add-ons for like pictures and everything. The one that I chose was Apple logos for boss paper. So just what you want to do is you want to open it up, install it, but I already have it so it's modified. Alright, so once you have that installed, we want to go down back to our home page. Click on boss paper, open it up, and all right. So what we want to do is we got is we want to go to individual pictures, add, and the add-on that you just got should be under boss paper. So click boss paper, and then Apple logos or whatever you installed. There'll be a list of things that you can add. You just simply click on the pictures to um, see what they look like. Hey, I'm gonna add that one. Uh, yeah, so it's just pretty simple. And once you add them, you should turn on boss paper or enable it if it's not already enabled. Go to your home page, you should respring it or something. And there we go, your pictures should pop up at whatever time you set it. Um, Alright, so YouTube, I hope that helped, and I'll see you in my next tutorial.